how to make a five-minute presentation. Hello, welcome to Video Jug. I'm Vera Hughes and I'm the co-author of Teach Yourself Setting Up a Small Business. And I'm going to advise you on how best to approach making a five-minute presentation. At networking and other business meetings, you're often given the chance to stand up and present your own business. Now do seize every opportunity that you're offered. Step one, prepare. Preparation is vital. First of all, think about your audience, because every audience is different and needs to be approached in a different way. Write down what you think they know already, what you want them to know and what you want them to do. This will lead you nicely into the content of your short talk. You'll want to highlight what your business is offering and what sets it apart. It might be flexibility, competitive pricing, or perhaps a really top quality consultancy. Think about visual aids. In five minutes you won't have time to do a PowerPoint presentation, but you might be able to take along a sketch or a design or a sample of your work. And if you're opening a retail shop, you could take something from your stock. If this is your first presentation, you might like to jot down the main points on colour-coded cards. It'll keep you concise and on track. Oh, and do write big enough so that you can read it. Step two, rehearse. Assemble your marketing material. Take enough flyers and brochures and business cards for what you'll need at the meeting. Rehearse in front of a mirror or a friend and time yourself so that you become familiar with everything that you want to communicate within the allotted time. And do use any props or examples that you're going to take with you. Step three, appearance. Think about your appearance. If you can, wear a colour which contrasts with the colour of the background of the room. A man in a white shirt standing in front of a white screen tends to disappear. Choose your footwear carefully. For one thing, shoes say a lot about you. And for another, they make you stand and walk differently. So choose a smart, comfortable pair in which you can walk tall and walk confidently. Step four, making your presentation. When you stand up to make your presentation, check the starting time so that you can be sure to stick to the allotted time. Take a few deep breaths just to steady your nerves. Stand tall and balanced with, with your head up. Don't lean on the furniture and don't fidget. Well Say stylish. your name and the name Without of your business clearly. If you're using cards, hold them in one hand. Don't put them on the table, otherwise you'll find you're talking to the table and not to your audience. Oh, and do embrace the whole group. Turn your whole head and body towards them. Sometimes you'll find a nodder in the group, and it's very tempting to talk exclusively to somebody who seems to be agreeing with you. Make your two or three main points slowly and clearly with a slight pause between each, and demonstrate as appropriate. Refer to your printed marketing material, but don't hand it out during the presentation. Make sure it's given out either before your presentation or after it. And do end on a positive note with a call to action. Step five, follow up. Hand out your flyers and business cards as appropriate. And have a pen and a notebook handy, so you can jot down details of any contacts that you've made. And follow these up within 48 hours. Now... Congratulate yourself on a great presentation.